guys, Assalamu alaikum. My name is Mustan and I read in class 9 in Iram Public High School, Shapur Chakra. Today my topic is virus. First we will discuss about discovery of virus. Virus has been taken from Latin language word viron and venom which means poison and it discovered by Ivan Hoskin in 1892 when he first saw the tobacco leaf in microscope so he saw a type of poison and he named it virus and uh, when uh, Vedam Stanley saw uh, same type of poison in electronic microscope which he named tobacco mosaic virus and our next step is structure of virus there are two states of virus one temperate and second violent Violent means it is active and if, if it is active, so it can be start to destroy the cell. That's called lytic cycle. And second is temperate means virus is inactive and doesn't damage the cell, but it can be active. It's called lysogenic cycle. And a structure of virus made up of two things. One coat and second is coat. Coat made up of protein coat. And inside the protein coat is capsid. Capsid made up of capsomers, subunits of capsid. And core has nucleic acid. In, inside the nucleic acid is DNA or RNA. A virus can never, never have both nucleic acid. Some virus have an extra protein coat called glyco, uh, glycoprotein coat with spikes. And there are our examples. First, malaria. Second is influenza and COVID-19 and third is pox virus. Malaria is a disease caused by a female mosquito named Anopheles and first time when malaria appears so the scientists of those days thought the disease is caused by a polluted air because malaria is taken from Latin language word mala means polluted and area means air. But a French doctor Lebrun thought the idea and he collected 100 blood samples of malaria patients and he saw in microscope. So that confirmed the malaria is caused by plasmodium because he saw in microscope the parasites uh, of plasmodium and when malaria attacks on nuclear of brain so it can be cause of that. There are, there are uh, two, uh, three and four kinds of malaria, plasmodium, PYX, and uh, dengue and chikungunya. These this disease caused by mosquitoes. And our second example is influenza and COVID-19. So the flu is very common disease in winter season and uh, known as uh, flu but uh, caused by influenza virus which discovered by Dr. Richard Pfeiffer influenza. This virus is uh, with spikes, so it's very dangerous. And these symptoms are severe, oh, severe fever, muscle pain, headache, and uh, etc. But uh, flu and COVID-19 is the same symptoms basically. Uh, especially young people have experienced the agencia and anosmia. The anosmia is a lack of smell and uh, agencia is a lack of taste. But, uh, in COVID-19 uh, it is very important to wash our hands and uh, uh, ventilations from crowded rooms and we are also wear the mask and uh, maintain the physical distancing. And Third is pox virus. The epidemiology of smallpox caused by the virus uh, Biorthopox virus variola and the transmission of uh, variola virus generally occurs through the in inhalation of large airborne respiratory droplets of infectious virus and a uh, transmission usually required prolonged face to face or any other uh, close contact and a secondary attacks rate of 50 8.4% in unvaccinated and a secondary attack rate of 3.8% in vaccinated and we should maintain the physical uh, distancing. Thank you.